Alright, I'm back with another tutorial because people can't apparently read a written guide and figure it out. Um, this is a tutorial for Reshade 3.0. We're going to start by going to the Reshade website, which is reshade.me. You're going to click the download button, and for whatever reason, they're just going to drag you down to here, and you need to click download a second time. And it's going to download this exe file. Just wait for it to finish downloading. It shouldn't take long. I've already finished it, so I'm just going to close that. And once you've downloaded it, simply open the exe file. And this is going to pop up. You're going to hit Select Game. And you're going to find your Blade and Soul file. Your client.exe, it could be 32-bit or 64-bit, it doesn't matter. You click client.exe, open. You're going to select open GL. And you're going to uh, click yes, you want to download a collection of standard effects from GitHub. And you're just going to hit OK. And now you're done. OK, that's it. Reshade is now installed. Now, if you want to use my specific preset, which is the guide that I originally made that people can't figure out, here's what you're going to do. You're going to download this file right here. It's going to take you over to Mediafire. And you're just going to download that. And it's going to say, this file can hurt your computer, but trust me, it can't. There's nothing wrong with the file. And just click keep. That's going to download the file. Now if you come back into here, you'll see I've already put the BNS reshade preset dot any in its correct location. Here it is. This is where it's supposed to go. Same place as your client.exe. The same place as where the reshade folder should be. Right here. Alright. Now we're going to go ahead and log into the game. Maybe I should play some elevator music while that's loading. And once you log in, you'll see here at the top that it's loaded up, reshade, loading up all the different shaders that you can have. And if you push F2, you can see how to configure it. Here it is. Uh, you're going to want to select the reshade preset in the drop down menu. And. Um, you can play around with all these settings all you want, do whatever you want to do. But that's it. That's all there is to it. It's super, super simple. I don't know why I needed to make a video about this. It's so easy. Anyway, there you go. I hope this helps any of you out there that were having issues. Good luck. Thanks for watching, and if you enjoyed the video, be sure to give the like button some love, and don't forget to subscribe.